or sand painting. You obviously need your design on cardboard, a piece of newspaper, some bottle glue, a toothpick, one per person. You only get another one if yours breaks. And every table will have a container full of different cups of sand. Yes, there's very little in each cup. And that's for a reason. There's a very small amount in here. That way, if someone accidentally pours the wrong color in the wrong cup, we're not messing up a whole bunch of that color. We just mess up a tiny bit and throw it away, and then I get you some fresh. Okay? We want to do the big areas first. And the way it works, put a little bit of glue on there. So you have just the line. And then spread it around. It's like you're coloring with glue with your finger. And then you take the sand, whatever color it is that you want. Gonna make a blue head. And dump it on. Shake it off. And that color gets poured back in the cup. So bend the newspaper, pour it in. Always pour it back in the cup before you change colors. Yes, I have a little bit that goes outside the lines. That's part of what your toothpick's for. Anything that goes outside of the lines, we just scrape off. And you can always wipe your toothpick off on your newspaper. So it's getting recycled later. It's better to go a little bit too big, a little bit past your edge, than it is to stop short. Okay, areas like this. Well, once you have one color on there, you have to think before you dump. So, a little bit of glue, spread it around, make sure I go all the way to the edge of the pencil line. Take my next color. And dump. Have to be careful when I get by that blue. And when I shake, I have to think first. I can't shake up because this is fresh and the brown will get stuck to the blue. So I have to shake down and fold up. Bag in the cup. Anything extra or big nasty chunks, take off. You have to do it while it's fresh. You cannot do it when your glue is dry because not a whole lot will happen. It won't come off your page. And that little spot I missed, I'll put a little bit more on there. All right. And since I just dumped more on my newspaper, stop, pour it, repeat. So you want to start with the biggest objects, start in the middle, and then work your way out. We're not doing the fine details yet. We do the fine details after this stuff is dry.